hardworking religious girl that is saving herself for marriage and through some unfortunate incidents becomes artificially inseminated. Bang. I play a zombie. She got turned into one, she was a medical student and now she is having to eat brains in order to survive and she's able to solve crime when she sees visions of what happened to that person before they died. It really subverts the idea that you become a zombie and you're just this undead force. It's You're still engaging with the people around you and you still have personal problems and she doesn't want to eat brains so she tries to do it in the most ethical way possible by eating the brains of dead people. I mean on my show I have a baby daddy and a fiance so I'm working it out. I've had to uh, remove myself from my fiance, my now ex-fiance, because I'm scared of giving him zombieism. Yeah it's unfortunate so she's trying to work out how she could navigate a personal life too. An Ooh. elementary school teacher? I think that's what I wanted to do. Yeah. If I wasn't acting, I'd be a doctor. Actually, yeah, zombie play came naturally to me. It was learning how to be a medical student that was alarming. <laughs> Curb your enthusiasm. I Ooh. think I'm a little dated now, but I am curb your enthusiasm still on repeat. Game of Thrones. Oh. Mmm. <clears throat> I worked on little Xena. I worked on Xena when I was little and oh I played little Xena. Oh my god! And I always looked up to Lucy Laws. I have to touch her. Touch me, virgin. Mm, so I love Xena. Now she's just copying mine. <laughs> yeah, I had nothing else to say, it's true. Hey, what's up everybody? I'm Gina Rodriguez and I play Jane in Jane the Virgin. And I'm Rose McIver, I play Liv Moore in iZombie. And, and you're, you're watching, watching TV, TV Guide Magazine. Magazine.